essentially patients who have peripheral arterial disease or atherosclerotic blockages in their arteries, predominantly in their legs, develop a lot of different symptoms. Critical limb ischemia is an advanced form of atherosclerotic disease, and it's multifactorial. Most of these patients frequently have diabetes, they frequently have problems with cholesterol, and they have cardiac comorbidities. Symptoms start with pain in your legs when you're lying in bed, a feeling of numbness and tingling in your legs, and it can develop and progress all the way from ulcerations to gangrene. If it's not treated, it results in amputation or limb loss. In a center such as this, it's our responsibility to use every technology that's available and advanced to treat these patients. Here at Columbia Presbyterian Medical Center, we have all of that technology. We offer a wide variety of treatments for atherosclerotic disease. They include atherectomy, using wires and catheters to enter the blockages, cleaning out the artery with atherectomy, using balloons, using stents. In addition to that, we offer advanced surgical therapy as well. And we utilize what we think is appropriate in a trial setting so that not only do we benefit the patient, but we are able to look at our outcomes and benefit future patients. With the team approach and with the team approach that we have at Columbia Presbyterian in general, we use that same philosophy in the Critical Limb Ischemia Center. Most of these patients have diabetes. We have an endocrinologist on site who can manage that. In addition, and very importantly, we have a wound care specialist and a podiatrist on site. What it allows us to do is to create a plan for you on site so we can communicate right then and there with you, with your family, with your referring doctor. We can come up with a plan and we can implement it expeditiously. I see patients who have been seen by several vascular specialists who everybody tells them they need an amputation. They come to Columbia Presbyterian. Everyone on the team from the endocrinologist, the podiatrist, the wound care specialist, myself, my entire staff, our goal is to tell that patient what they want to hear, and that's that we can save their leg.